On May the 14th, 1796, Dr. Edward Jenner treated a young dairy maid, Sarah Nelms, for cowpox. Cowpox was common amongst farm workers and generally took a mild form. It was, however, closely related to the much more serious smallpox. Nelms was not gravely ill and would recover within days. She did, however, have fresh smallpox lesions on her arms and hands, with the pus or infected matter from these wounds, Jenna deliberately infected eight-year-old James Phipps for the purpose of inoculation for the cowpox. When Phipps only experienced minor cowpox symptoms, Jenna completed the most dangerous part of the experiment. He inoculated the boy again. This time, the infected matter was not cowpox, but its deadly cousin, smallpox. No disease developed, nor did it in 23 more patients, one of whom was Jenna's 11-month-old son, James. The experiment that would revolutionise the medical approach to an infectious disease had been successfully completed.